The ladies are waiting for you today. Not only today, but tomorrow as well, and the day after tomorrow, and you cannot miss it out. That's why we're gonna go out on the streets, and guys, they're waiting for you. What are you doing over there? What? Here we go. We're standing here with Kirsty from where are you from, Kirsty? London. London. Wow. What's London like? It's cool. It's, it's cool. Place. And where are you at right now? Uh, we're in Pai, which is just north of Chiang Mai in Thailand. Beautiful. You're traveling with your friend? Yeah. Okay, beautiful. A couple questions for you. When you choose a man, when you're attracted to someone, what is it about them that you're attracted to first? Uh, if they're tall. Okay. Me. <laughs> so height's important. Why? Because I'm so tall. How tall are you? 5'11". You're 5'11". That's bloody tall. <laughs> Do short men approach you sometimes? Sometimes, yeah. Yeah? yeah. You automatically say no. Pretty much. Oh my god. Unfortunately. Oh wow. It doesn't leave me much choice. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Not at all. What about good looks and or money? If you had a choice between the two, um, how important are they? Oh, choice between the two? I think I'd be more attracted to looks than money. Yeah? What type of looks do you like? Um, I've got a bit of a varied, varied look. I like uh, the tall, I like um, surfery dude looks, uh, long shaggy hair. A little scruffy here and there? Yeah, a little, uh, yeah, a little Facial bit. hair? Oh, wow, wow. What about confidence? Is that important to you? or? Yeah, because I'm not very confident myself, so yeah. I think the guy's got to be confident. Oh, you got to get some balance going. Yeah. What is it about confidence that does it for you? I mean, what is it? Um, it makes me feel a bit more secure that they're, they're wanting to talk to me, maybe, and that they're interested in me. That they're, really? That they're confident. So you're saying when a man approaches you, you find that pretty alluring already? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh, wow. Because I would never go up to a man. Why not? Look at you. You're, you're beautiful. You're be look, guys, look at who I'm interviewing here. Look at her. I mean, she's a gorgeous woman. She's got a nice figure, great smile, great personality. Why would you be a little bit shy about getting approached? What is it? I don't know. I don't know. I think it's just me. I'm just oh. always been shy. Oh, that's cute. That's very endearing. <laughs> now, um, another question I have for you. When you flirt, do you use your body language, bat your eyes, or do you just kind of talk your way through it? I try to, yeah. Yeah? I was talking actually my, to my friend the other day, and um, I'm not very good at it. Oh, <laughs> She's my better. God. better. You should talk to her. Really? Yeah? <laughs> um, but yeah, I think out. it's more the, the eye contact and, yeah, body language, definitely. How can you tell a confident man from a not-so-confident man? Um, I think the way he speaks, if he's got if he's got stuff to say and he's he speaks well and isn't all shy and like, but his body language yeah he's not I noticed you're shrugging yeah. your your elbows yeah. I mean your elbows your shoulders like that so a person who doesn't take up body space and is keeping themselves enclosed to you is yeah. sort of a shy person yeah I think so wow 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 one last question and I will let you go <laughs> how did you get so cute <laughs> I'm not <laughs> who's telling you this bullshit <laughs> My gosh, come on. Are the guys in Britain like just totally blind or something that no. can't see your beauty inside and out? No. Oh man, we gotta we gotta work on this one. Is he, what do you think? Is yeah. she beautiful? Thumbs up. Oh, see? You got a well, thumbs up. You. So I wanna thank you for the interview and um, it's just been a pleasure. My thank pleasure you. meeting you and the guys are gonna really respond to you and thank you I very much. So. Shake, shaking thank hands, you. see that? All right, she's great. Say bye. Bye bye. Hello. Hello. What's your name, hon? Lisa. Lisa, where are you from? Uh, London. London? Yeah. What are you London. doing in Thailand? Um, just a bit traveling. Yeah. yeah a bit of holiday. So. Okay, I'm going to ask you a couple questions. Yeah. Lisa, when you meet a guy, what's the first thing you look for in a guy? Um, to be quite honest, probably I would like if he was attractive or not. Um, and after that, it would be. What's your name? Holly. Where are you from, Holly? I'm from England. You're from England. How long have you had that problem? <laughs> you laugh. That's a good start. Holly, can you tell me, what's the first thing you look for in a man? Uh, to be honest, I'm probably fairly shallow. <laughs> no, that's fine. Just tell me the truth. Guys want to know, how shallow are you, Holly? Um, well, they have to be fairly good looking, you know. They have to have something about them. I kind of like a bit of a... I like... I like a bit of an edge, 
You have to have a bit of an edge, you know? Mm -hmm, not, mm -hmm. not too nice. Mm -hmm. Too nice is... Boring. Know, boring, yeah. It's <laughs> not a turn on. Um, and funny. Funny's good. Wow, that seems to be an important one for women. Yeah, funny is good. That's great. Uh, one more question. Actually, two more questions. Tall men versus short men. What's your preference? Middle's just fine. Ooh, I like how you got out of that one. Middle's just right. Okay. Good looks or money? Good looks. Really? Definitely. Money doesn't matter. Money's a very small thing in this world, really. Makes the world go round in a way, but... For me, personally, not something I look for in a man. Absolutely. Uh, one more question since we're on a roll. <laughs> you are great. One to five questions, yeah. Absolutely. She's getting higher. Um, how important is a man's member? A man's member? Depends what he does with it. <laughs> You're the best. I love you. Say good night. Good night. So we're here with Pear. And you're from, where are you from? I'm from Bangkok. You're from Bangkok, and how old are you? I'm t 23 years old. Oh, beautiful. I have a question for you, Pear. Ha. Do you like men who's tall or short? Tall. Tall? Tall, yes, tall. <laughs> really, why? Why do you like guys who are tall? Why? Yes. Um, mm, smart and mm, maybe handsome. Yes. Yes. Uh, then shot. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like man who is funny or serious? Uh, funny. Funny. Why? Mm, um, funny. Uh, I like fun, uh, boys. Funny to like, like me, like me. Oh. Okay. Okay. One. One last question. One more question. Do you? What's important to you? Uh, if your man or your boy is, is he, if he has money or, or if he has personality. Uh, um, personality. Uh, well, Pear, it's been great, and I really thank you for your time in doing this. Thank you. And very you're a very ha. special lady and very, very beautiful. Uh, thank you, Ka. Okay, thank Ka. You, ha. Bye. Bye, ha. Bye, ha. See ya. How are you? I'm well, how are you? I'm great. What's your name? Hannah. Hannah? Where are you from, Hannah? Australia, Byron Bay. Do you mind if I ask a couple questions? No, no. Good answer. <laughs> what do you prefer in men? Uh, confident man or non-confident? Confident man. And why is that? I just don't want someone boring. I like someone confident, knows what he wants to do. A bit jazzy, for example, Tom. Okay. He's a confident man. What makes him confident? Which one is he, by the way? Tom's the middleman in the green. The middleman? Yes. The tall guy with all the nice hair. Yeah, he has The Jesus Christ hair, I call it. <laughs> yeah, and the strawberry brown strawberry. beard. You know what? He's pretty damn tall. Look at that. How tall is he? Hannah, how tall is your man over there? My man, but he is about six foot. Okay. Maybe more. You know what? Speaking about men in height, which do you prefer? Tall men or short men? Oh, well, I've had a... Probably tall. I'd say tall. Yeah, yeah without tall, doubt. I like them to be taller than my, my, me. And how tall are you? I have no idea how tall I am. Why do you prefer the taller men? What, what if a really good-looking short guy came up to you and wanted to talk to you? He was about here. I'd chat to him. It wouldn't, it wouldn't bother me at all. It wouldn't bother you. No. There'll be nothing in your brain about it. I would say to myself, oh, he's a bit shorter, but I'd still chat to him and see how he's going, ask him his name, all that kind of thing. What if he made a lot of money? No, that wouldn't bother me. It doesn't matter. Money is money. It comes and goes. So, if you have it, you don't have it, you're still... It's all about personality, really. What's the first thing you look for in a man when you, uh, when you choose somebody that you're attracted to? Um, attracted to? Mm -hmm. If they're nice. You have to have a nice personality, you have to be approachable, smile, nice smile. Uh-huh. Yeah. And the last question, penis size, does it matter? Does it count? <laughs> you laugh, you laugh. Well, I can only say I've only ever slept with one person, so sure. I haven't really, don't really know. You know what's so My cool? My size is really great. I like it. Enjoy it. <laughs> Fellas, here we are with Kelsey. And Kelsey, you know what? Where are you from, hon? Canada. Canada. 
What part of Canada are you from? Toronto. 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 I love Toronto. <laughs> uh, a couple questions for you. Sure. Uh, when you're dating a man and mm -hmm. you first meet this guy, whomever it is, mm -hmm. you know, what is it about him that, that gives you the interest that, hey, I think this is somebody I'd like to get with? Um, he has a really good sense of humor. If you can't make me laugh, I don't think we'd last five minutes. Um, and he's got to be really laid back, take things easy, just kind of roll with it. If he's too uptight, it won't happen. Uh, tall, sh tall man or short man? What's your preference? Tall. Tall, why? Um, my man's 6'7". I don't know. I like Wait a tall. minute. You're like, what, five and a half <laughs> inches tall? Look at that. I mean, my feet come up to your head. Yeah, How did no. that work? No, just kidding. Yeah. So your man's, what, 6'7"? Six 6'7". Six seven. Six seven. Yeah. Wow, he just approached you like that? Just, hey, how are you doing? And what, what was his opening line to you when he saw you? Uh, actually, it was me. Would you say confidence over good looks or good looks over confidence? Confidence. Confidence, why? Confidence. I don't know. It's just, you know, anyone can have good looks, but if you don't have confidence in yourself or if you don't have confidence in your actions in life, you're not going to get very far. Looks can only take you so far. Wow. Rich man or poor guy? Poor. Why? Uh, they have a better outlook on life. Um, rich men don't always, maybe, maybe stereotypical, but take things for granted. Poor yeah. man has to work harder and can appreciate the simple things in life. And the more confident a male is in approaching, then she's going to want to talk to you more. How important is humor, you think? What well, really important, because if you don't have no humor, then she's just going to be distracted by other things. You know, you're not going to keep her interest. So you need to have humor there to, you know, further cement your personality with her and build that relationship. It builds trust quicker than anything is humor. Right, 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 right. Would you consider, consider yourself a confident man? <laughs> You laugh, but I'm asking a serious question. No, yeah, of course. You of have course. to be, because confidence doesn't just help, you know, this department of your life, like, getting a mate. It helps every diff every aspect of your life. So once you're confident, like, I'm doing this now, yeah. like, even though I do this some sometimes for my work, sure. but it's like, you have to be confident about yourself. You have to believe in yourself. And once you believe in yourself, you can get that confidence. Guys, to waiting for you. What are you doing over there? What?